afternoon. I am just walking into the centre of town to get a haircut. I fancied a bit of a change, so I thought, why not? It's not as cold today, actually. Obviously got the old uh, winter jacket out, but it's not actually that cold. You'll get a little bit of a before and after with the haircut, but in the meantime, you'll get to see what I describe as my Peter Parker and Spider-Man 3 hair. It tends to just kind of flop forward and I haven't done anything with it. The other thing to mention is that Dream Bakes and my hairdresser are literally right next to each other. So that may prove to be quite an interesting combination this afternoon. <laughs> I'm off to Dan and Hannah's for dinner, which I'm really looking forward to. And obviously we haven't picked a winner of the pumpkin carving competition. So it's gonna be Hannah's job tonight to pick the winner. So it's gonna to be totally blind. It's just gonna be pictures and numbers and she's gonna pick the one that she thinks is the best. Okay. So, um, are you looking forward to this? <laughs> Am I being filmed right now? Yes. Oh, okay. <laughs> so, so you can, uh, you can read this. <laughs> so, so yes, I am looking forward to it. Yes, yes, yes. Good. You obviously, do you know who participated in this? Um, you, yeah. Dan, yeah. Lizzie and Tim. That's right, absolutely. So there are four submissions. Okay. Also, out of all those people, who do you, at this point, if you're thinking, who, who's done the best one? Who do you, who do you think, like, um, oh, I think that the I'm, best one? I'm thinking probably, in my mind, I might unintentionally choose Lizzie's just because she's a girl and it might okay. be a slightly girlier. But I'm going to try and not base it on a girly, um, just the best one. I'll so, <laughs> this is number one. Okay. Okay, so that's okay. it. Yeah. Uh, what are your initial thoughts on number one? Um, I'm not sure whether the thing around the top is meant to be hair or like a <laughs> rainbow. <laughs> Interesting. But, do, you um, mean at the, do you mean at the top here? Yeah, no, that, no. That's just the, part of the point. No, the part, the part <laughs> out bit that kind of looks like a bob. Right, okay. Interesting. Um, that kind of looks like what it is. Um, it also looks like the, um, the guy from... Uh, Nightmare Before Christmas. Okay. Yeah, I feel like more needed to be poked out of the eyes. The eyes are quite dark. Interesting. There we are. <laughs> okay, on to number two. It's there. That's an original idea. I like that. <laughs> I'm, I'm a fan of that. I okay. think it's really original and it's quite well done. I mean, it looks similar to the font. So. Oh, there we go. I like that one. There we go. Okay. It's not very scary, though. <laughs> I mean, if we're going on scary, it's not very scary. <laughs> but is... I do like the originality of it. Excellent. Okay, so this is number three. Oh, I like that. That looks like Jack Skeleton. I think it's got probably the most um, Halloween-y type feel to it, but it's also quite well executed as well. Okay, so this is number four. Okay, um, I don't really know what's going on with this one. <laughs> it, is it sad or is that the nose? I like the holes around the eye. Oh, it looks like two suns. Oh, okay. And an arrow up. <laughs> Interesting. Okay, so I'm going to have to ask you to make a decision. Who do you think has won Star Carver? <laughs> That's quite a tough decision. Because so is that all I'm basing it on? The best carved pumpkin, yeah. not well, on well, originality of design. Well, it's on all those things. It's just whatever you think is the best and is your favourite. Because you I'm, I'm probably torn between the middle two. Okay, I so... think the Friends one is really original and I do okay. think it's quite well. I think that's quite hard to carve. So I think that's quite well executed, but then I like the third one as well. I think the third one's the scariest. You think the third one's the scariest? Okay, so I'm gonna to have to ask you then, Hannah, to decide which one is your favorite, and then I will tell you who has done each one. Mm, that's a hard decision. I like them all, but I think I'm gonna to have to go with Number three. Number three. Fantastic. Thank you very much. <laughs> I feel like I'm on a yeah. blind date. <laughs> I'm going to go with number Still, three. I think I'll have to go with number, number three. three. So, I can now reveal to you that number one was in fact him. Okay. Number two was me. Oh, really? Yeah, absolutely. A bit of a change there. Number three was Lizzie. Oh, okay. And number four was Dan. And I'm surprised I mean, that you I don't get that. really get what that is. <laughs> So there you have it. The winner of this year's Great British Pumpkin Carve-Off is Lizzie. So congratulations, Lizzie. So we're going to have some dinner now. Hannah's cooked us a lovely meal, and then we're heading out to do a pub quiz. So it's good night from us. Oh, 